Yes, uh, I take this opportunity to, to welcome each and everyone. This is our second day. If at all you can see it, and uh, we apply, we are putting up the poles, our poles. Uh, remember, I told you that we we apply the the termites medicine, uh, and after that we wrap our timber or our poles with the DPM material or you people you call it the chivera the reason why we do uh, we do all of those we need double protection of our poles we need to protect our poles from termites and other insects that may might might come to 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 them and secondly we have to protect our poles to from rotting the wetness of the soil uh might bring up uh, the rotting of our timber so with those i think uh, our timber can last for long or our poles may last last for long that's why we do such the spacing i'm going to talk about it but you can see it we are not going to leave that soil like that we are going to put some maram under our structure and uh, we drain it to where we need uh, uh, the, 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 the water in case there is a lot of water and the exercising ground everything we are going to be showing you just stay tuned and watch us please if you know anyone who may need such structures then our contacts are down you can find our contacts on our channel here and uh, you put uh, you give that person our contacts because many people need such services but they don't know genuine people to trust uh, with uh, that work so we are available and we we work for you to give you the quality super quality work that you may require or you need at the farm remember this structure is going to house uh, more than uh, 700 goats uh, on a zero grazing system we already have our feeds for our goats and uh, the only one the only thing that we are remaining with uh, that is the <coughs> the only thing we are remaining with uh, that is the structures and the goats so please stay tuned and uh, watch us thank you very much if at all you can see these poles here uh, this structure it is 100 by 30 feet uh, and uh, to make it very standard uh, we make sure that the spacing of the poles in the <coughs> in the length side make them to be uh, three feet apart uh, that makes them to be near each other and uh, each pole it will be having a cross on it uh, meaning that uh, our our timber will be seated on those crosses uh, remember this is a raised structure that's why I'm talking about the crosses and uh, uh, that makes our structure or our timber uh, remember our timber uh, we castinate it with with the nails to be very strong and uh, if at all uh, we also know the weight of, of, of the animals that we are going to put on this structure so with that aspect or oh, with that condition that uh, we put in place we make sure that our structure is very strong and uh, is very ready ready to withstand each and every uh, weight uh, that uh, we are going to put in it so uh, this is our second day and we haven't completed it actually uh, before today ends I think we shall be having the crosses 
open it